Hello, this is Julian with Copy Reviews, and here's a brief introduction into my YouTube channel. Now, a little bit about myself. I've been into specialty copy for the past 10 years. I spend a lot of my time going to cuppings, uh, traveling to try different shops, trying different roasteries, ordering different copies, um, just basically exploring the third wave copy scene. Now, the goal of this channel is two things. It's to, first off, get a lot of people that are unfamiliar with third wave and specialty copy introduced to what exactly it is and how it differs from what people perceive as dark and bitter copy. And then the second thing is to review and discuss with people familiar with copy, different coffee roasters, um, new products, and maybe get a discussion dialogue going about what others' favorite coffee roasters are and well, what's new, what's always changing in a really big, really different, basically, industry. And I'm going to go ahead with a little bit about this channel. So this channel was inspired by a YouTuber and co-founder of Square Mile, James Hoffman. I really enjoy the material he's putting out, and I really enjoy the feedback he gets from the copy community. And the copy community as a whole is probably one of the best things I've ever dealt with. People in the coffee community love discussions they love talking about coffee and i'm in that same boat i want to discuss coffee with you and everybody in the world about coffee it's my favorite thing it's the thing i'm most passionate about and the types of things i'm going to be looking to do on this channel i'm going to be looking to review new roasteries i'm going to be traveling upcoming here so i'm going to be reviewing some coffee shops as well as uh, some of their offerings uh, possibly some new product reviews. I know that there's some things coming out and of course news for anything that is copy related, uh, possibly things, experiments, uh, new, proce new processing methods from some major coffee roasteries. And I feel like it would be great if I could get some communication with people back and forth, uh, hear things that uh, they're curious about trying. Uh, hear their opinions on some coffee roasteries, um, some coffee shops, um, maybe even some thoughts about the differences between what people consider these second wave shops, um, the expansion of places like Blue Bottle, um, La Cologne being all over Whole Foods and into the new like, mainstream sort of thing. A lot of these big coffee roasteries are becoming main, more mainstream these days. So, uh, the coffee rating scale, that's one of the main things I did want to discuss in this video real quick. Um, I'm not associated with Coffee Review, the website, in any capacity at all. What I do like is their method for reviewing coffee. Now, I'm going to be using their 0 to 100 scale, and for me, anything below an 80, I'm never going to be drinking on this channel. I like to stick to the third wave specialty coffee, and I feel like anything that would be below that 80 threshold I can't recall ever having anything done by a specialty roaster that would be considered less than an 80 for me. 100, of course, is going to be the rare exception. I feel like in my lifetime, I've maybe had one, two copies I would ever consider basically perfect. Like, nothing I would change about it. Taste, everything done was to the absolute perfection. And then the 80 being something that probably is on the lower side of things for a specialty coffee roaster for myself. And, I mean, it happens, but, of course, it's not to say it's a bad cup of coffee. So, I'm going to start posting some videos of some reviews coming up here shortly. I have a trip to Denver that I'm going to be taking a couple of videos for. And I appreciate any sort of feedback, any sort of comments, any suggestions, any thoughts. Um, feel free to let me know, and I will read every single message and do the best I can. And thanks for watching.